we've done some great things in our first 50 years. We need to make sure the next 50 years we accomplish other success. Metro Louisville is looking for a nonprofit or for-profit group to manage the city-owned Louisville Zoo. 30 years ago, most of your zoos were owned and operated by cities, counties, and states. Throughout the last three years, that, that percentage has transitioned the other way. If the 120 full-time zoo employees are no longer city workers, the zoo can reduce the high costs of a public pension and government health insurance. And it's through this RFP process, that's another huge consideration, is making sure we have the best outcome for the staff because they are great people. So you're going to want to make sure that, in other words, that there is some kind of plan for those folks' retirement and health care. That, that is something that needs to be part of the process, absolutely. Zoo director John Walzak says whoever takes over must also promise to continue to renovate exhibits in an award-winning fashion while keeping ticket prices accessible. Our last three major exhibits have been voted the best in the AZA, which is basically, we're, that's a global accrediting association, so we've created three of the best exhibits in the world. We're incredibly proud of that. If city officials don't like any of the zoo proposals, they could consider forming a nonprofit to take over management, he says. I know the administration, the mayor, and myself were committed to, to making sure that whatever the outcome is, it's the best for our community. Mark Vanderoff, WLKY News.